Hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's Forza Thong guide called Above and Beyond which wants you to own and drive the 1972 Land Rover Series 3 to complete all of the challenges with. So without further ado let's get stuck in and take a look at the Land Rover in question to complete in this week's Forza Thong. So this is the 1972 Land Rover Series 3. It will set you back 20,000 credits from the auto show or you can pick one up a little bit cheaper in the auction house potentially. Now the first challenge here simply wants you to upgrade the Land Rover to a C-Class and win a cross-country race. So of course I've got a tune for you guys to use called Forzathon C-Class and the share code is 891821457. Now the cross-country race I chose was the Horenda Cross Country Circuit. Here I have a blueprint event for you guys to use called Forzathon Cross Country and the share code is on your screen there. This is simply one lap with no AI driver tires, so you're guaranteed a win. And it'll pretty much just take you just over a minute or so. Um, it's really quick and easy to do, and you're guaranteed a win. Um, now, the next challenge here wants you to earn two stars at any Trailblazer, which again is really easy to do. But we're going to spice things up a little bit and do another upgrade to the Land Rover. So here I have another tune for you guys to use. Share code is 119224185, and this one's a little bit quicker. Now the trailblazer I always use for a challenge like this is called City Escape in the centre of Guanajuato. Now to do this, what I also recommend doing is finding where the finish line is and setting a destination waypoint to it. That way you've got a direct route to it. Now the other thing is this trailblazer is probably the quickest and easiest one in the whole game. Uh, and actually you're guaranteed three stars on this one. It's really not long at all. Um, it's super easy to do, especially if you've tuned up the Land Rover a little bit more. You can probably just about scrape two stars if it's C-Class, but I just wanted to get it over and done with a little bit quicker and make the challenge a little bit easier. So that is the second challenge. Now moving on to the final one, just want you to earn an ultimate wreckage skill. So to do this, I recommend heading over to the airfield or anywhere where there's lots of smashables. Of course, by now, I'm sure you know how to get a wreckage skill. It's just by destroying a smashable object. And an ultimate variant of that is just by continuing to do that until you work your way up from wreckage to awesome wreckage, great wreckage to ultimate wreckage, just by smashing as many objects as you can before the skill chain runs dry. And that is this week's Falls of Them Complete. Now, hopefully this guide has helped you out. Um, if you have any issues or you have any troubles, please do let me know down below in the comments. I'll be more than happy to help you guys out. But if it did help and you're new to the channel, I'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe and dropping a like massively helps me out as well. But apart from that, folks, I want to thank you very much for watching. I want to wish you all the best. Make sure you stay safe and take care.